Hi, today I'm going to show you a short tutorial of how to use dropzone.js effectively and efficiently. Dropzone is a good package for uh, uh, for uploading and downloading at the same time deleting uh, images or files. Right, and the example I'm going to show you today, let's cross that, uh, is, one, is one of the projects I did for one of my customers. So, uh, to start with, I have a model allow the user to pick up the item that they want to see the pictures inside of it and then I currently the maximum picture I set is six so they can upload the six pictures at the same time they can delete them right they can delete them so every single time when the delete button is pressed I use Ajax right send the data back to my PHP and delete it from the actual server um, the uh, the difficulty I met when I use dropdown.js is uh, before I haven't used the model right. Let's just imagine the the model isn't existing. I I allow the driver to, uh, the the user sorry to select the item they want to see, and every single time when the selected item is changed, I have to clear right this space and show the new pictures however with drop zone it's difficult to do that because if i clear the zone right it will actually call um, the delete uh, function of my php file so if you actually delete all of them which isn't uh, not what i want i just want to clear the uh, the space but uh, at the moment based on my understanding you, you, it's not programmable so what it did is come up with a model a design so if the user want to see the other uh, pictures for different items they have to uh, refresh the page and select it right so that's why I have a model in here and uh, uh, yeah so if you have a similar project and uh, and you want to know how to use drop them the js you should watch the next video thank you